Tracy, thank you very much. Justin, at 638, we go back to our live Team 5 coverage this morning. It begins with my Sunrise co-anchor, Courtney Ola. She's out live at the Eagle Point School District office. Teachers are on strike right now. Looks like a lot of them behind you, Courtney. Good morning. Austin, good morning. A very chaotic scene here, as you can see. Um, the protest is on. The strike has officially happened. It is May 8th. The union said if there was no negotiations and uh, no decision made, they would go on strike. That's exactly what's happening here. They are circling the district district building. Now we have spoken to both sides on the issue. We've spoken to the union and we've also spoken to the human resource director of the district. This is what we know so far. After 17 hours of negotiation, there is still no deal. Now the district plays placed a proposal on the table around 4 a.m. this morning. They still have not heard back. So right now, what they're talking about is what to do with the students. Well, things have been in place. Schools are closed today. They said it's likely schools will remain closed until Friday, but substitutes, they are set to go into these schools. Some teachers are still going to be teaching as well. The district told us the students will be absolutely taken care of until something uh, comes comes down. Now they're going back to the table right now. The district says they are waiting uh, for the union to come back with another offer because they did put that uh, proposal on the table. Now really quick, some of the sticking points. It is still uh, teacher prep time as well as instructional time and also insurance for part time workers. The same things we've been telling you about for days now. It doesn't seem like they've really made a decision. Courtney, can you hear me by chance? I can hear you. You can. Okay, quick question for you. So tell me again about Friday. Is it that, What's happening Friday? I missed that. Sorry, okay, right. Well, they were telling me that schools will most likely remain closed until Friday. They're closed today, and they just want to make sure that uh, they're getting everything taken care of, that the substitutes are getting into these schools, that they're getting the lesson plans in their hands so that the kids are really well taken care of. They do expect schools to open on Monday uh, and everything really resume as normal, except uh, with these substitutes, obviously. But as I told you, Austin, they're going back to the table right Right now, so hoping for an agreement. All right, a lot, a lot of information happening right now at an Eagle Point. Courtney, we'll get back to you soon. Thank you so much. Great job out there.